So I have 24 cards here that uh, I'm going to be submitting to CGC. Just wanted to do a quick video to uh, show what I'm submitting and to document what I think the grades are going to be. Uh, anyways, this is Sean here. I uh, appreciate you stopping by. So let's go ahead and jump on in. Starting first with special delivery Bidoof. A lot of Bidoofery on this card. A little bit uh, heavy left to right on the centering. So I think this card will get a 9. Uh, so we got the base set Charizard here. Uh, this is from the original collection, my original collection. Um, you know, I have a six back there. I think this one might do a little better. I'm hoping for a seven or eight. Uh, next here, you got the reverse hollow Charmeleon from the legendary collection. Uh, this card, really clean. Again, one of my originals. Hoping for an eight. GameStop promo from Obsidian Flame Umbreon. This one looks pretty clean. I'm sending it in because I think it's a 10. Skyla here. Now, Skyla is from uh, Shining Fates. This one, not perfect centering, but close enough. I'm hoping for a 9 or a 10 on that one. I have several, so you know we'll, we'll sell the others if it comes back a, a good 10. Got the Garantina V-Star here. Now, this is from Crown Zenith. I truly believe that this is a solid 10, if not a gold label 10. Glaceon, again, another beautiful card. This is from Evolving Skies, one of the alternate arts. Easily a 10, in my opinion. Uh, Serena here. Now, Serena is from Silver Tempest. I have several of these. Uh, the goal is to hopefully get a 10 on this one so I can sell it and help pay for, uh, for some of the submission. Iona from Paldea Evolved. Again, I'm thinking a 10. This Rayquaza, Rayquaza, it's the EX Delta Species Reverse Hollow. This one is gorgeous. Tiny bit of white showing right there. Otherwise, a strong 10 candidate, in my opinion. I, If it gets anything less than a 9, I'm going to be heartbroken. Uh, Karen here, this is a Black Star promo. Uh, from what collection was this again? Um, uh, hit me up in the comments if you remember. Oh, it's the Trainers XY uh, um, um, series there. The Trainers XY collection is the word I was thinking of. Uh, not in perfect shape, but a little bit of white. Hopefully an 8, maybe a 9 if we're lucky. Mumbrian from the Evolving Skies. This is an easy 10 candidate, in my opinion. Same with the Rayquaza. Easy 10 candidate, in my opinion. Here's a card that uh, unfortunately has a, a crease through it, but it's, it's one of my uh, more favorite cards. It's the Neo Premium uh, File 2. No rarity Charizard. And uh, just love this card. You know, shoot, if I get a 3 on it, I'm happy. Uh, hoping for just a numeric grade on this. This is the uh, Neo 4 Shining Charizard, Japanese. Love this card. Personal collection card, both of those are going to PC. So I just want them slabbed. Gengar Alternate Art from Fusion Strike. Easy 10 candidate, in my opinion. Same with the Mew. Although the Mew does have... Is it this one? Ah, uh, there was maybe a little bit of white on it showing. I can't remember. Uh, then we're going moving on to Ditto. This one's going in the personal collection now. The front is a little bit worn, so I'm hoping for a mid grade. You know, otherwise this Ditto is not bad looking. It is the reverse hollow. Just love this card here. Charizard EX from the Obsidian Flames. This is special illustration rare great looking card Skyla from Breakpoint another ultra rare uh, oh by the way Charizard I think is going to be a 10 Skyla probably you know in that 7 or 8 range and then we'll round out with a couple more Charizards we have Champion's Path Charizard V this one should get a 10 Charizard V Max from Shining Fates and then we have the Charizard V-Star from Brilliant Stars. Again, I think another 10 candidate. And finally, Champion's Path. Charizard, the V-Max, Rainbow. Should get a 10. 
All right, hey, welcome back, Pokemon fans. Uh, so here are the results from my latest CGC return. Uh, from door to door, it was about a little over two months. So they didn't make the 20 days that they were claiming, but uh, I'm still pretty satisfied. So here is the special delivery Bidoof, and you can see I got a Mint Plus 9.5. Excellent, they're happy about that. Uh, I was hoping for a 10 on the Skyla, got a 9.5, but that's quite all right. Not bad there. Uh, GameStop promo Umbreon uh, scored a nine. A little disappointed, hoping for a ten, but that's okay. Love this card here. Uh, got a nine on the Delta Species Raquaza. Uh, beautiful, beautiful reverse hollow, in my opinion. Very happy on that return. Uh, the Mew got a mint plus nine and a half. This is the Fusion Strike uh, alt art there. So VMAX, beautiful card. Ah, the Obsidian Flame Charizard uh, pulled a 9.5. Couldn't get that 10, but that's okay. Obsidian Flames, beautiful card. Charizard. Sticking with the Charizard theme, uh, here is the Brilliant Stars. Mr. Zard got a 9. I was thinking of a 10 on that one. Uh, here is the Champion's Path. Uh, this is the rainbow of Mr. Zard, nine and a half mint plus. Again, I was thinking about a 10. I uh, missed on this one a little bit, and I, I now see why. I only got a five and a half on the base set Charizard, which is fine. We'll take it. You know, I got a six back there on the wall. I was hoping for maybe a little higher of a grade on that one, but uh, it's all right. And then the Legendary Collection uh, Charmeleon got a six and a half. So I'm happy there. I was thinking it would get a little higher, but it didn't. That's okay. Uh, here's some good results. Garantina V-Star there out of Crown Zenith. Uh, got the Gem Mint 10. What a beautiful card there. Uh, alt Art here, Glaceon V from Evolving Skies. Got the Gem Mint. Love this card. Uh, Serena. Got a Gem Mint 10 out of Silver Tempest. That was a good return there. So Iono, Paldea Evolved, Gem 10. This is one of my favorite cards. I, I like this Karen card. Uh, Karen from, it's a Black Star promo. And it's from the Premium Trainers XY collection. Got the 8.5, which I figured it would get that. Uh, round an 8 is what I what I thought. Beautiful card here, Moombreon, the VMAX uh, alt art from Evolving Skies. What a beautiful card. That's spectacular. Rayquaza from Evolving Skies. Got the 10. Pumped about that one. Excellent return there. Uh, so from uh, my old collection, here's the Neo Premium File 2. Um, Charizard, Japanese, Reverse Hollow, got the four and a half, and I figured that, that it would, it would get a lower grade, a lower to mid grade. There's a, that, it's not a crease, but kind of a bend up there in the upper right hand corner. I just wanted this card for my personal collection cased up. So, uh, here it is. Shining Charizard, Japanese, Darkness and to Light. Got the one and a half fair, which I'm perfectly happy with. I uh, just love, love, love that card. Gengar out of Fusion Strike. Got the Gem 10 for the alt art. Here's another PC card here. I'm just very pleased with. Ditto Sky Ridge Reverse Hollow. It pulled the 6 because there was a little bit of, a, I guess, wear or scratching there on the front. So very pleased that I got a 6 on Mr. Ditto. Uh, Skyla from Breakpoint. Got the eight. Perfectly pleased with that. Again, these are all PC cards, so I really, it doesn't matter. Charizard V here out of the Champions Pack. Gem Mint 10. And the last Zard is Shining Fates. Got the Gem Mint 10. Anyways, I appreciate y'all watching. Thank you. And uh, if you like what you see here, let me know because I'll keep doing submission videos. Uh, my daughter and I have uh, another submission that's going into SGC this time. And there's some bangers in there. So anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Y'all take care.